designers and engineers have done a brilliant job. Every line on the car is there for a reason. Some of them will be there for functional reasons, some of them will be purely for aesthetic. They're all relevant. You try to imagine yourself as the customer. You try to get into their head and understand what they want, what they need. And then it's a case of trying to capture that through the architecture of the vehicle. Great design is a gateway to customer desirability because it's design that makes that emotional connection. It's unmistakably a Range Rover in terms of its DNA elements. The first word that comes to mind is, is drama. It's incredibly powerful. It's got athleticism. But yet it's a highly sophisticated piece of vehicle design. This is the fastest vehicle that we've ever created and uh, the exterior design does need to express this dynamic capability. It's got beautiful proportions. It's got this longer wheelbase which makes the car look grounded. And you'll notice these lamps that wrap round which trick the eye in and make the car look more compact, tighter, more precise. We've introduced the panoramic roof on some of our other vehicles and it's something that has really resonated with our consumers. It's that modernist approach to bringing the outside in. Did we want the car to be evolutionary or revolutionary? Whenever we replace an existing model, we always ask that question. In the case of the new Range Rover Sport, I think our consumers are ready for something that is not thinking about the past. You know, we recognise our roots, but we're not harnessed by it. You know, there's some cars that make you turn your head, there'll be other cars that make you walk into a lamppost. This'll do the latter. The car is revolutionary.